Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the main release. In this video, we are talking about the build 22631.4249 for version 23H2, but this is very likely to be one of the last, if not the last update before Windows 11 24H2 is starting to roll out to users on the main release. And in this video, of course, we're going to cover everything that is new in the main release. For those of you who are not enrolled in the Windows Insider program, these are the new features that you will encounter starting today. For some of you they won't be rolled out and for others they will be rolled out so pay attention to that but if you want to manually enable those features we're going to have more info about that in the article below if you're interested so first of all on the main release microsoft is adding the option to share files directly from windows search for example if i search for a wallpaper and then i click on this you're going to see that in the right side i have the option to share that file and it's going to open the share section inside settings windows update advanced options and then deliver optimization microsoft updated this page to match the windows 11 design so that is pretty nice also the share section in the file explorer is receiving some updates and has a new design with new options in the main release the windows lock screen now includes media controls in the lower part of the lock screen at its center when media is playing and related to the start menu if you go into the account manager you're going to notice that now the sign out button is present right here in the right hand corner and if you have multiple accounts on your computer you're going to have an additional option with three dots where you can easily switch between your user accounts there are also features that are rolling out normally so all of you should encounter them but they're mostly fixes related to the microsoft edge microsoft fix an issue that sometimes cause edge to stop responding when you use the ie mode users no longer need to enter their credentials more than once for outlook or other encrypted email app a user will be prompted for their pin one time only related to the copilot pro subscription if you go to settings and accounts you can now manage your copilot pro subscription settings and related to the task manager microsoft fix an issue that made task managers to stop responding when you switched from a high contrast theme to the normal theme. We're also receiving the Windows 11 service in stack so that it can easily and reliably install Windows 11 updates. That is pretty nice. And more info about this build, as I've said, will be in the article below if you're interested. But the main things are the ones that I mentioned in this video. As I've said in previous videos, stay tuned on the channel because I'm going to update you even more related to Windows 11 24H2 when it's going to be released because, of course, it has been delayed. It wasn't released on the 24th of September, but it should be somewhere early October and we should have Windows 11 24H2 very soon. If you enjoyed this video, please please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Jumani from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.